the Pantheon, funded by Psycherborg, brought in to be his bodyguards, facing off against DEST, Koichi's personal unit, basically a personal military almost. Oh, nice face muscle. Jugo definitely won that one out. Real faction war action going here. Bunch of offense there from Junko. Ooh, almost making this look like a fighting game. Oh, this is the end of Man, Manages to get up into a head scissor. Yupter now going for a cheeky pin. That is awfully brave of him. Nick we're going to stand there from Yupter. Jugo's not going to stay down for that either. Hits the running ends agree that time. I'm going for a tag out for Kudo. Yupter is already gassed, and now he's got to take on one of the best strikers in the MMWF. Uh-oh. Getting put back in the corner. Might be... Oh, fighting Junko once again. Double team action from DST. Yupter has got to get ready for a hot tag on his tag team partner if he's going to have hope to win this match if we actually see the hot tag work. Mongolian shot. Some big strikes here being absorbed by Yopter. Big head scissor there. And now Yopter going to tag in the much fresher Whitney, but Junko kips up and tags in Kudo for the better matchup. And you got to feel like that's smart ring work. Oh. Kudo went after Yopter. Now he's got to turn around. He's got Whitney waiting for him. Uh oh. Head oh, scissor God. pin. One, two. Yopter almost had the block. You gotta ask, how much offense did Kudo take from Yopter before this? The inverted figure four here, really attacking the legs of Kudo. Yopter had the block there, but Kudo able to work his way out of it. Dash punch from Whitney. Oh, reversed. I think Whitney may have been going for the side slam there. Didn't have the strength to keep Kudo up. Now Kudo's looking for something big, I think. Gets behind Whitney. Oh, step of Enziguri. And that Enziguri slammed Whitney headfirst into the mat. He followed through with his foot in such a way, it almost became like a foot DDT. Oh. What, what, is that a sit-up powerball? The blue thunderbomb. <laughs> Amazing move from Whitney. A blue thunder, but now it's going to get countered. With the Empress Lock here. This could be the tap up, but Yupter's got the Yupter's got the break up there. Both of them using big moves. Whitney going deep in her arsenal with a blue thunder bomb. Kudo's now going to come in, and you got to feel like Whitney's days are numbered. It's a few strikes there. Maybe big reversal. In comes Yupter. Oh, back stabber! Oh, behind you! Yeah. That could be it! <laughs> uh, and Kudo just walked right into it! When he had the block! Oh my oh goodness! My God. Pantheon oh, wins! Kudo looked at Yunker like a dope <laughs> instead of doing anything about the behind you! Well, I gotta say, I think, uh, you know, we're talking about number one contendership for cruiserweight title. I think Yopter said a move. Yopter was handling Kudo Ryu pretty handily this Absolutely. whole match. Kudo was so busy warming up that Yopter just spun him around and hit him with the, with the behind you without really any resistance, and that gas and punch successfully blocked it. Whitney with the good defense there. She's already coming out of the ring, and she's uh, celebrating here with Yopter. I, I can see that she's uh, eyeing down the commentator booth right now. You know... <laughs> Pantheon <laughs> needed a win tonight. Whitney getting a tag win. That should help elevate her. And Sarah, after watching Kaz's win and after watching your sister's win tonight, <coughs> being left off the car, getting the bye week this week, is starting to already look like it's hurting you. You know, 
yes and no, because I can I rebound pretty fast from things like this. But I'm gonna come back next week and I'm gonna show people who's boss. And it's gonna all be okay. Men and Mama versus the Justice. Wow. So chat is unanimously behind the Pantheon. Mostly, it leaves a bad taste in our mouth. But there's a, but they are uh, definitely for them. Dest goes zero to three. You uh, you gotta feel like Dest possibly uh, people are really, really against Dest as much as they don't like Psycherboard. DEST represents such a danger to this Fed, and I think that people recognize that. Holy shit, Black Velvet. Yeah. You know what? Do we want this in the freezer? Probably, yeah. Oh, Trap, I took a look inside of the hot top. Uh, Jason, I looked inside the hot top bag. Oh, that's. Yeah. <laughs> I figured I knew who it was for, so I was like, oh, that's cool. Uh, yeah, if you come sit over here so I can watch them. Well, the crowd is already uproarious for Taco Truck as they're coming out to the coming out to the ring next. Taco Truck definitely, you know, in, in a fed full of grays and blacks, and they're a, a taste of the white, you know what I mean? That sounded way wronger than yeah. I wanted to do. You, you they're want to try a ray of lights. In the, the gray, in amongst the grays and the blacks. Oh, we did have a white lash last night. Why not? Whitney, hey guys, I'm back. Whitney, you are feeling good after that surprise win. And like I was telling Sarah, this helps your stock in the Valkyrie Division race. Well, you know, I know this is important stuff here, guys, but Justice for All are coming into the ring right now. Um, great tag team took the titles from the Pantheon. Have they looked beatable since that point? Not really, and I gotta tell you, if the crowd was if the crowd was cheering for Taco Truck, they are on their feet screaming for the Justins. The Justins are basically they've got to be two of the goodest good guys in this Fed right now. I know what I said. They're so good they fart Care Bears. Covered in barbed wire. Ned and Fields will start things off in this tag team matchup. Exchanging some strikes here. <clears throat> Fields with a Russian right sweep. Fields is doing very well. He's got to use that advantage in speed, speed agility against Ned. You get in a strength fight with him, you're going to lose. Ned, one of the top five wrestlers in the Fed right now. As Ned showing his size and his power, just going right over oh, field. Oh, jeez. And once again, just showing that pure strength. Roxy, what was that move? That was a, uh, just a rear waist that took down. He was hitting some uh, big right hands here, Ned. Fields now puts Ned into the ropes, into the turnbuckle here. And uh oh. Oh no, this is dangerous country here. What 
What a superplex. Fields had the uh, dubious honor of hosting Mark Sykerborg on the penalty box this week. Yeah. A lot of mixed... A lot of mixed reactions from around the fan about Psycherboard's words. And Dallas is doing a number on Dad here. Oh, my goodness. You know, I talked to Downs before the show today. He wants to put on – he wants to end DEST on his own. He wants to make that fight his own fight. He, he's willing to join up with whoever he needs to to make sure that DEST is pushed out of the MWF and that Psycherboard is pushed out of the MWF. Uh-oh, Ned with that ginormous Luthes press. Maybe you're trying to tech out from Mamba. Mamba, at the absolute bottom of the power rankings, has yet to win a singles match in the 2K16 season. Ooh. A tag match here would definitely help him out, though. Most of the boat. And Amaya Rana there on the downs. Mamba off the ropes. A big German suplex from Downs. Definitely a very damaging maneuver there against a stretch of small guy. That's such a small guy. No, I, I, I really feel like Downs still has a bit of a size advantage on Mamba. Mamba feels like he's still a little bit, well, actually, it looks like he's now taller than Dust, Justin Downs. I don't know, maybe some camera trickery. Oh! He's about an edge shoulder. But, uh, yeah, pop-up drop kick there by Mamba. Very impressive. Another one of those tricky cruiserweight wrestlers. Mamba going for the shins there with the sweep. Downs staying grounded is good for Mamba. Oh, Mamba going up top here. Oh, oh, oh he clips the him. elbow. He clipped Downs in the face with that elbow. That's that's how you break somebody's nose. Oh. Downs here going for a big comeback. Hits the sling blade. Mamba's down. Downs has an opportunity here. Mamba, though, is going to smartly tag in Ned. <laughs> and Downs, Downs is tag smartly in tagging in fields. Uh oh. Oh, sit out, Spinebuster from fields. The strength of fields just popping him up like that. One, two. He has the Matic armature in the side of that. Ass Fields here going there. for the table. God damn, kills me. <laughs> well, Justin Fields, as Ned eyes him down, says, oh, it's going to be like that, huh? And now both Justins are tagging up on Ned, and what the hell is that? Fields hopped up on our table and posed for the crowd a little bit. But now he's up to a three count. This entire, this entire thing has backfired on him. Fields here trying to decide what he wants to do. Getting a little fresh air there. He still has uh, quite a bit count to go. Oh, and Ned was caught. Caught staring eyed and got caught by Downs. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Fields once again taunting for the crowd. Downs just took out Mamba. Fields setting up for the biggest vertical suplex brain buster I've ever seen him do. Here's the pin by Fields. One, two. Oh, Mamba with a key breakup. Mamba was not down long enough. Ooh, big reversal from Ned. Downs got complacent. Downs here trying to grab Ned again. To get it. Oh, oh what a DDT. DDT. Pin by Justin Fields. One, two. Uh-oh. Downs wheeling Mama around and throwing him out of the ring. Oh, up and over. The Justin seemed to be in control of this match here. Justin... Fields with a huge clothesline. Down just destroying Mamba outside the ring. Another Field. cover here on Ned. One, two. Ned's dazed. Fields sees his opportunity. I think some back elbows here on Ned. After the back elbows, here's a pin. One, two. Getting another kick out. Oh, oh and Ned's busted open. open. The crimson mask. Hey, Jason. 